Tulsa. I just had a lovely evening with some friends. I had Steph, Megan, and Kristoff over. And it was a great day. Well, night. Great night. But speaking of my day, um, I was painting today, always. And we're painting for this older couple, um, Ray and Anne. And it was kind of like Danny and Annie flashbacks like crazy. Both of these people were married previously. They're in their late 60s, I'd say now. They've been together for 20 years, married. And they're just so happy. No, okay. They're both so happy. And it was so cute hearing of the story of how they got married. Because Ray really wanted to marry Anne. going on? I don't know. Okay, anyway. So, he really wanted to marry Anne. And so, they both discussed it. They both knew they wanted to get married, but her thing was like, you know, who do they invite? How do they have the wedding? Like, she has kids. How's this going to work? And then finally, they were going on vacation one day. And Ray said, when we're there, we're getting married. And they did. But then they needed witnesses, right? You need witnesses. And so they couldn't have just them at the wedding. So Ray runs out in the street, grabs two people. Those were the witnesses. <laughs> I thought it was so cute. But just like all day, you know, he would be working in the garage. She was just cleaning and all this stuff. And she would just come out and they would just talk. And they would just hold hands. Like, break my heart in half, Okay. And they have tea time together, and they eat together, and they had, she has an Irish accent, he has a British accent, so it just makes it so much more beautiful. God, like, how do you find that? You know? And she was telling me, she's like, Sandra, if you don't get it right the first time, it's okay. She's like, don't rush into marrying anyone, you know, really take your time, make sure it's the right person. And she's given me all this life advice, which is just so adorable. Like, you're so cute. Love it. We're done that job, but I'm kind of sad. You know, I liked having them. And she came out and gave me tea and cookies twice a day for the past three days. Like, it's awesome people. So, I don't know. Like, it was really just a, a value and appreciation of a random stranger. She reignited something in me today, which was just beautiful. Even strangers can teach us something. Anyway, I've got two friends waiting upstairs for me. Because, yeah. I wanted to vlog in private. Anyway, I just wanted to share that tidbit with you all. So, have a good night. Bye.